which brings us to a different question I can ask which is all sometimes referred to as the base theorem which is not sometimes actually it is the base theorem or sometimes referred to as the posterior probability so the definition then is so the 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 point of posterior probability is it's asking if you knew what probability of a given b is can we find out what the probability of b given a is well that's that's in some sense the nutshell of Bayes' theorem, but um, but as we saw, the way we visualize Bayes' theorem or, or see the point of Bayes' theorem is we have uh, what we call as uh, causes and effects. We observe an effect, and we want to know what is the cause for it. So let's say there are many. many causes so let's call this cause cause one cause two cause three there are many causes that can result in so cause four all of these causes can create an effect this is the effect we're looking at so it's possible that there is a somebody has uh, has a, a condition that has been that they've been diagnosed with but this condition could be the, uh, the consequence of having uh, high blood pressure or having um, you know, being diabetic or there could be many effects that could be the cause of the condition that we're looking at or they they came up positive on a test and the reason for being positive could be either they have uh, they have uh, they have uh, c1 c2 c3 or c4 so that was the test that they came up positive on and the 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 reason for it could have been any one of these now the question then we, that we're asking is given that given that they have come up positive what is the likelihood that their their positiveness is is because of one of these causes and that's the that's the question we're asking so we saw we saw how we can frame this question um, and so probability of b given a is so we can derive Bayes' theorem by realizing that probability of B given A is probability of A intersection B by probability of A but probability of A itself can be written as so we can rewrite this as A intersection B by if I want to find out what the probability of a is I can write this as the probability of A with B occurring plus the probability of A with B complement occurring so this is now I can rewrite my numerator as based on my definition right here which says this is probability of because remember that this is what we are given this is what we are trying to find out so we're writing that and so we write this as probability of b times the probability of a given b divided by the probability of b again times the probability of a given b plus the probability of 
B complement given times the probability of A given B complement. So one of the things that we often ask ourselves is we are given probability of A intersect A given B how do we find out from that what the rest of the information is. So uh, this is where the tree view is can come handy and I would refer you guys to my my slides and the examples I worked in class that will show you how how you can assess, assess what so we know what probability of B is so we can find out what the probability of B complement is is just 1 minus probability of B and we can similarly find out what probability of A given B complement is because if we draw a tree diagram then uh, when we when we go from uh, when we go from uh, our tree which says here is what B has occurred, B complement has occurred, then we see that our definition is basically taking this is A given B complement and then this is A given B and so this term and this term together the sum of these two terms is my denominator because these two terms are this is B times this is the probability of B times the probability of A given B this is the probability of B complement times the probability of A given B complement so that gives me what the probability of A occurring is which is this and we that's our denominator and the numerator is just this term which is what we have so um, I will move on to my next topic and let me do this I will again delete everything and start with my new